if you want to change your life you have to do the uncomfortable you have no choice like the reason why i'm saying this is because i was talking to a client today and she was complaining about all her problems right she has a lot of problems and like she, she financially first of all she has a lot of problems financially and she has a lot of goals that are unachieved that she wants to pursue but she wants to heal herself first and that's okay fine mind you but you have no choice and why do i say this because you want like i'm using this as an example because you need to understand that you want you need to do the uncomfortable especially if you want it so my client studied communications in university and she's very good at communicating which is which is awesome she wants to grow her youtube channel and start helping she has a good cause for her youtube channel she wants to start helping young women realize their potential and different things she has different plans for her life which involves communicating and media and, and talking to the public and helping people of course right that's what a good business is helping people serving people serving others that's what a good business is but she is getting in her own way because her excuse is she doesn't want to show herself on camera and that's why i got the inspiration to make this video because you have to do the uncomfortable if you have no choice because you have no choice because you want it you want the success you want to live a better life you want to become the highest version of yourself you want to be a better person that you will respect right you want to become a person that yourself respects so you have to do the uncomfortable you have to pick up the phone because i didn't just get used to picking up the camera and recording myself I've been doing this for years and years and years and years and years. And there are times where I've done it, posted it, deleted the video, come back. I'll go in a depression spree, come back, do it again, post the video, come back, do it again, post the video, give up on myself, do it again. For years, to get to this point where I am now comfortable and I don't care, I just do it. You know, I don't care, I just pick up the camera. Especially when I know it's for a good reason. I want to talk about something good and impactful that will help people's lives. Why not do it? Right? And the benefits of me helping people's lives and helping others will benefit myself. It will benefit me monetarily. It will benefit me financially. It will benefit me emotionally. It will fulfill my purpose in life. It will give me a purpose in life. Like, oh, yeah, I fulfill my purpose. I'm helping people. People love my videos. They love my motivational talks. They love what I do to push them to the next level. So it's helping me. I'm, the world is a mirror. I'm helping people and it's helping me, right? So you have no choice. If you're poor and you're stuck in that state... You're stuck being that person that you don't want to be. You have no choice but to do the uncomfortable. You have no choice but to do the uncomfortable. You have to forego everything else because this is what matters to you. Don't sacrifice your dreams and your aspirations because of other people's thoughts. Oh, when I post myself, what are my friends going to think? What if this person is going to think? What if I, it, I fail? What if this? So what? So what? And the beautiful thing about life is that you realize that... Like, I used to have this anxiety where it's like... Okay, if I post this video and my friends see it... Or somebody I don't even know sees it... Or, you know, different imaginations or the girls that I'm dating see it... And, you know... I'll be so embarrassed and what will they think of me? They'll think... Um, oh, I, I'm getting 100 views on YouTube and, and um, I don't have any money. I, I think the I think the dumbest shit, honestly, I think some stupid ass shit that doesn't even matter. But when I started posting, posting my videos and they were going viral and different people were seeing it. Like I went viral on TikTok and I got like 700,000 views. And all my friends seen it. Everybody in my city had seen it. 
people recognize me randomly who have seen my TikTok. I was like, wow, this, this is amazing. And guess what? It didn't matter. I still got girls. I still had friends. I still had all the things that I thought I was going to lose by being myself. I still had all of that after. So I was like, damn, at the end of the day, none of that even matters. I was just creating scenarios in my head about what is going to happen because I'm scared of the unknown. When you are scared, like when you are doing something that you don't know the outcome, it becomes scary. Oh, I don't know the outcome of me posting every day. I don't know the outcome. What's going to happen at the end? 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 So you start to predict it. Oh, this is going to happen. That is going to happen. But the truth is, you don't know. The best might actually happen. The best thing might actually happen. The video goes viral. Your life changes. You support so many people. You help so many people. Or whatever it is you do, you start that business. It, it blows up. It becomes the best, best restaurant. It becomes the best business. It becomes the best startup. It becomes the best app. But you never tried. Because you are scared of going into that unknown blind. It's like driving a car in a foggy road. You don't know what's next. A deer could pop up. But one thing you know is that you trust the road. You know that the business you've thought about, you've thought about it, you've thought about it. Oh, this business, oh, people like food, so I want to start a restaurant. You've thought about those things that, okay, this is, this is something that could work. You've thought about it, you know that it could work. There's a possibility. And the beautiful thing about it is that you will learn, even if it doesn't work the way you thought it would, you will learn something from it. You hear stories of people that say, oh, I, I started my first business and I failed. But that was, but me failing, I learned so much that my second business made $10 million in two months. Did they know when they started that first business that they will end up in another business? No. Do I know if posting these videos will be my end and all be all? No, who knows that one of my videos could blow up and I go into acting. But what I'm, I embrace the unknown because the unknown is actually beautiful. I don't know what God and the universe has planned for me. I don't know. It might be more magnificent than I can, than I can conceive. And it's the same for you. So you have no choice. Do the uncomfortable. Just do it. Cliche to say, but just do it. Do the uncomfortable. Get uncomfortable. And build those muscles. The uncomfortable muscle. Do those things that make you uncomfortable and wonder if... You're going to lose it all and lose all your friends. And, and when you come out on the other side, you'll be like, wow, nothing happened. So let me do more. And it becomes more exciting. It becomes like a game. You start to build that muscle. And you become more confident. Before, I couldn't even walk in the room and talk to... Like, I couldn't look people in their eyes in real life and talk to people eye to eye and say, hello. Especially women. I grew up going to an all-boys school. And I couldn't walk up to a woman and talk to her eye to eye without looking away and being shy and thinking, oh, does she think I'll just be in my head thinking too much. I won't even be in the moment enjoying her beauty. Right? But it took practice. Now I can go anywhere and talk to the most beautiful woman without even wanting her number. I just want to talk to her to build that muscle, like I said. Exercise that uncomfortable muscle. Do the uncomfortable. You want it. It will only benefit you. Stop giving excuses. Stop giving excuses. Do the uncomfortable because you want it. You want to start that business. You want to start chasing your goals, your dreams, your aspirations. You want to do those things that make your heart pound. But you're getting in your own way. Don't get in your own way. It's beautiful on the other side. I'm a living witness. I promise you it's beautiful on the other side of uncomfortability. It's beautiful on the other side of unknowing. Of the unknown. What you don't know is on the other side. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. You will learn a lot and you will come out. Pressure builds diamonds. Another cliche thing, but pressure. When they are shaping metals, they put them through so much heat. Put it through heat. Mm. And it 
turns into a beautiful a beautiful object after but it has to go through that heat it doesn't know what is going to happen at the end the metal doesn't know but the sculptor knows right god knows where you're going the universe knows where you're going your higher mind knows where you're going your higher self knows where you're going so don't doubt yourself take that action post that video start that business build that website start selling order the first product build a sample product get the samples one of my friends let me just even wrap this video up with, with it I, be, I play basketball in LA fitness and one of my friends that I hope with he just started this clothing brand amazing he's so creative he made some mad ass shades creative shades and he brought it to the best place there are like 30 of us that come there on a frequent basis to LA fitness to hoop and he brought his shades and started showing it around everyone was like wow bro this is amazing I haven't even bought it yet but I'm thinking about buying it but going to I've been going for the past few days and all the guys are buying it he sold like five pairs already and he sells them for hundred dollars each that's five hundred dollars already and he just started so if he takes it online he starts doing promo he starts doing all these things where is he gonna go to the moon because he did the uncomfortable thing i'm sure he was terrified about the outcome oh what if people don't think my glasses are fly what if people don't da, 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 da. there you go peace if you need support i'm here to support you reach out to me i would love to talk to you speak to you and help you chase your dreams